Hey Kylie here, just wanted to do a quick video while I have the opportunity to show the different variations of the CKC2 that I've done and that are available because once these ship out, well of course I won't have any to film or take photos of or anything like that until I make up more because uh, that's just how it goes. So what I want to show is this was the wooden handled CKC2 and this was using the sheath style that's the thumb push ramp one for neck earrings neck use and this is a 2.0 with the high convex grind so you know as I said this is the leaner handle feels great in the hand slightly shorter blade and next to that we have one which is similar to sheath style again just like the ha the uh, knives are all unique my sheaths are all unique too uh, no one two are going to be identical so uh, nice firm fit so this shows you the same knife but with the screw on my carter handles and lanyard hole as opposed to the glued on one and of course there's nothing stopping you requesting a glued on version with my carter. It doesn't have to be screw on. So those are the two looks of the 2.0. And uh, got a couple left of these available in the high convex grind. Let me just... So there's a couple left ready to go in that style. Now the 2.1, this is the 2.1 in the Gameskeeper sheath that I did the testing with. So this is the removable handle scale one with the finished kind of left rough on there. And uh, as I said before, you know, this is just slightly bigger blade, you can see there, slightly bigger handle. Now, I just finished up one today, quickly, because this is going to a friend in UK, and he also wanted the 2.1 with wood handle. So, I quickly did this one today, and again, a slightly different sheath style again. I tried to keep this as lean as possible uh, for weight and form factor for fitting in a pocket or whatever. And, uh, but like the leather one, just one nice compact. And we did this one with Wenge wood. Let me just pop that out of the sheath. So pinless Wenge. Feels beautiful. Came out really good. It's a nice look to it. Very uh, comfortable in the hand. Yeah, good solid grip there. And uh, this one I just quickly put a brush finish on using Scotch Bright with the heavy convex edge. So again you can see the the look difference between the two there. What you get with the full wood compared to the micarta. And uh, the wing gear on this one's just been done a little bit thinner as well. So it's still got a very very secure feeling grip but slightly better for an even smaller hand than mine but feels very very solid good in the hand so mostly this video I just wanted to cover the look and feel of the CKC 2 range and as it stands now out of this batch. I've got a couple of the 2.1s, the smaller blade in the heavy convex and I've got another one of the original 2.1s in the higher convex. And again, you know, you look at the grind line on here, it's only going up to there, it's really more like what people call a sabre grind and that can still quite easily be finished off with quite a heavy durable edge as opposed to the super lean slicer that was put on these 
it doesn't have to be as thin as those. So these are available and it says there's a couple of the 2.1s. This is one of the very last CKC hikers just finished off that's in there for another video I'm about to do. Okay, so that's how they're going to look. There's only a few left, so if you want one, give me a PM. And uh, yes, I will be doing more, of course, but they may not be exactly like this. They may change again, be a 2.2. .2. We'll see how that goes. Thanks for watching.